as you look at the totality of the KC roster. Here's the rookie Gibbs to the left. Has good speed. First down, spinning and turning. Gibbs through a hard hit. Stays on his feet to the 25-yard line. In which they've run him at least 50 times. And what you see out of the Lions can be so frustrating. This little counterplay to the outside. And good athletes. Two rookie picks are out there. Laporte of the tight end in motion. Gibbs the back, running to the right, to the edge. And Gibbs stays on his feet. Gets the first down. And he goes out of bounds right at the 46-yard line. I tell you, it's nice when you've got a center that can pull out in front and get that block. That's pretty darn good by Frank Ragnow. That play is... Draw play on third and 20. There goes Gibbs up the middle with a pounding run to get into plus territory. Gibbs again. Oh, wow, he slithers through the hole for a first down and continues to punish on his way to the 29-yard line. Plus, right here in the middle, get caught. Double team up front. Here he is, off the block. That's Jackson. Halapuli body by time on that offensive line. They're still trying to pound the ball forward with Gibbs. And a first down. And Jameer Gibbs sets up first and goal for Detroit. What a run right here. Watch this double team inside. Just, I mean, you want to talk about throwing Onyemata on the outside and opening up a wide lane for Gibbs. Yeah, St. Brown, six catches, 50 yards now. Couple of fakes, get it out to a screen to Gibbs. Has blocking, Tamir Gibbs. First down, Gibbs still going down inside the 10. Just Gibbs doing what he does best, which is run in the open field. They want him to operate in space. That's where he's at his best. Second and one, Gibbs on the pitch, has some room, Jameer Gibbs, no one touches him, he's in for six. Taylor Decker, the big left tackle, he's going to pull out, he gets out in space, nice crack block, watch, watch Geno Stone, he's like, nope, I'm good buddy, we're up 35 points, that's a, that's a business decision, and then Penny Sewell, all the way from his backside right tack. The deadline day last year involving 14 players and 20 draft picks. Feel like we're headed for that kind of a day again. How about the day for Gibbs? Out of bounds with a big play and a catch and run in 15. You're going to see this, Jameer Gibbs. That's not how it was really designed. And, well, they look like they were actually coming back a little bit inside of that block that the line... Wearing their Honolulu blue helmet instead of their usual silver. A hand to Gibbs and Jameer spins still going and that breakout game that head coach Dan Campbell's been looking for for Jameer Gibbs may be on tap 24 yards for the rookie the look that they had they had a chance for a touchdown here's Gibbs boy what a night for the rookie out of bounds inside the five Dan Skipper comes in at left guard as they hand to Gibbs and Gibbs breaks it Touchdown, what a night for the rookie. Wow. Come back. Jameer, come back. Well, such a great job by Brock Wright. He's going to come across. He kicks out here. And then you've got Jameer Gibbs, who's one-on-one -on -one with really Amari Bernie right there in the hole. But he cuts back. He has great vision. He gets in behind that offensive line. And then he's able to make a man. First and ten. Gibbs again. Again, showing off. Goodbye. There he goes. To the 10. Oh, it's close. They're going to mark him out at the one or two yard line. Shoved out at the very end. Those have no chance, and we'll see. Hey, Hill, you, that's the correct call. Yeah, it's totally the correct call. But you remember, like, I don't know. We don't like to compare people, but we're going to compare people. You, can, you so, don't have to go very far outside of the Detroit franchise, do you? It's uh, different. I'm not saying, yeah, no, you don't like but you're right. Yeah, that. right. First and goal. And why not? They give it right back to him, and Gibbs is in for the touchdown. There's a lot of guys you could compare him to, but he's got a chance, a chance to make a name and a legend of his own. This guy's on the edge. He's got outside contains. So we're going to get him and then pull the guard. So Bosa's clipped, and then now the speed, he can just outrun. 
Second and seven. Oh, gonna go screen. Oh, it should be there for Gibbs. Got a block up ahead. Oh, and here he goes for another big gain. Yeah, there are all kinds of blockers helping out, like Graham Glasgow. It's a run, and then it's play action, and then it's play action to a screen. I mean, it's a really unique way of starting your foundation and allows Gibbs to use that, but that's why I threw back here, it's zone. That means he's got to come out and I'll throw it inside. I'm going to hand it off. Here's the hand off, and he's across. It's Gibbs for the touchdown. Great design call. You want to get something in the middle against that zone, and they decide to run it. Hey, Sewell, watch this right here on that right side. He just slams three guys down and opens up a huge lane. Look, you got guys on the ground there. Remember the last time they were down here, they did not give it to Gibbs. Those two teams will square off on Thursday night on Thanksgiving, Thursday morning on Thanksgiving. Here's Jameer Gibbs now. And good blocking. Taylor Decker's out there for Jameer Gibbs. Graham Glasgow threw a really nice block off the right guard spot. Well, the big thing about Gibbs is timing of the offense, the tempo of the run game. And he used to hit it so fast early. And Dan Campbell told us about week seven against Baltimore. They got Dan Skipper as an eligible man on the top side of the formation. Toss play coming left, Jameer Gibbs to the pylon. And the Lions take advantage of the takeaway. Just watch this. Everybody's going this way, and then just going to flip the ball over here to the running back. I mean, how easy is that? One on one, and my guy could beat your guy. Another blitz from the Bears. So the check down to Gibbs with a blocker in front. And he's down near the 10 yard line. Stevenson the tackle. Blitzers, blitzers coming off the edge and just dump it out here to your back. Easy peasy and then go ahead, get out there. We can get into a rhythm here, get St. Brown involved and go. Yeah, it's a great call. They haven't had any rhythm. Here's Gibbs. That'll give him some rhythm with a big seam. And Jameer Gibbs on the first play into Packers territory. The early explosives on first down that they've been looking for. They've been relying on this run game a lot in the first half. And now they're able to pop one. Inside the Saints 40. Here's Jameer Gibbs. His first touch of the day. And Gibbs has room. Breaking it to the secondary. Gibbs explodes and makes it first and goal out of Alabama. Well, you're going to see Elante Taylor come in here and try to make this stop. He follows the motion down. He's right in the hole. He's got to make that play. The offensive player, when you bring wide receivers in and you're playing man coverage, that's going to free you up in the hole to make the tackle. And Elante Taylor just completely whiffed on that and turned it into an explosive run. Big Penny Sewell over to the opposite side and get unbalanced right here. And they flip the line a little bit. Sewell, usually the right tackle, is working off the left, and Gibbs goes to the right and bursts through behind Dan Skipper instead. Yeah, they get such a look at look at all the guys over here. It's just wide open on this side as they flipped it open. You can see the space they've created. And there goes Gibbs right through that space on the unbalanced line with an extra offensive lineman. Very nice design out of Ben Johnson, offensive coordinator, to confuse the bear. Little flip. Here comes Gibbs. First down. And a touchdown as he moves past Jackson. And the Lions are on the board. Guys out here that you can go right here and right here. You've got Penny Sewell. You've got Mitchell out there on the edge. Great job capturing that edge. And I'm telling you what, those guys are running, blocking. Gibbs, big hole. Oh, a nice block by Reynolds. Great job of blocking on the left side. They catch him in a blitz coming off the edge. They're able to kick it out. Decker is here in the first half. Alan Ross and Brown was the target there. Second down goal. That is caught by Gibbs. Touchdown. And a second touchdown pass for quarterback Jared Goff against the zone you leave the middle of the field open see how I get excited when wide receivers I know like it. That? That's, you love it yeah. you want more of it first and <laughs> ten Gibbs oh like a rocket there he goes he gets around 13 into luck breaks that tackle look at him first and goal for the Lions well excellent
excellent job of blocking all the way across the board. Raymond getting a block again. And then the juke move, a block. And then one more juke. That allows everybody that's chasing to catch up to him. We were talking about some of the struggles they've had in the third quarter offensively. Were they going to be able to come out? Gibbs is in. First and ten. Laporta, a block. Gibbs turns the corner. And he is in for the touchdown. This Lion offense running to the left side. They go back to the left side, and once again, great blocks by the wide receivers down the field. Laporta on the edge, sealing. Three point Lions lead. Here's Gibbs. Cuts to the outside, still going into the end zone. Jameer Gibbs for the Lions touchdown. Between the tackles naturally, but then have the ability to burst back outside. It looks like he stopped right there. Makai Blackman expected someone to tackle him, and the speed to get out there beats everyone around. With the offense on the field on fourth down, and they convert. Woohoo! Gibbs still going. Oh, and he's tackled from behind. He had visions of the end zone. Now, watch what he does to a Caleb Evans. Puts a move on him, gives him the Skittles, and DJ. So the Vikings lose another key defensive player. Hand off to Gibbs, touchdown! Watch Penny Sewell, right tackle, gets up to the second level, takes Jordan Hicks right out of it, and nobody touches. Offensively against this defense, their ability to run the football on first down here he is again cuts back turns on the jets and sets up first and goal coming into this game look at the movement frank rag now he's up the field he seals everything off gives him a clean lane four teams over his first five years pretty much just as a return man the key guy is a receiver here here's a toss here's gibbs here's the corner and a touchdown I mean, just watch these guys out here, and then you've got James Mitchell coming in motion to pick up Josh Metellus. Cameron Bynum is fighting to get off Sam Laporta. And Josh Reynolds, 20 explosives out of 40 catches this year. Give you some idea. Gibbs up the middle to the end zone. Another Detroit touchdown. Watch this double team right here. Up to the double team, to the next level. Huge gaping hole inside. They've established the run. Now they swing it out and get it into the hands of the speed. Jameer Gibbs with a great move in space. Gibbs takes it to the 11-yard line. Again, no pressure on golf, but the Rams, if they're going to have a chance to win this game. Much on defense. Second and two. Gibbs, good move to the open field. Gibbs accelerates. Gibbs to the end zone. you to watch the cut when he gets up on the all-pro safety Antoine Winfield one-on-one -on -one, watch this no chance then just pure acceleration to the end zone and after a wild sort of defensive battle let's here go. we go let's go right here we go now it's Gibbs Trying to get to the edge, gets a block from the quarter, makes a man miss. Gibbs inside the five, touchdown Detroit! Talk coming in, they need to defend this play. Josh Reynolds, he sets the edge on Bosa, and now they can pull. Laporta's out in front. Glasgow the right guard, and... Third and long. Gonna hand off Gibbs. He's got a seam. Gibbs racing to the sticks. He's got the first down. They've handed off on third and 12 and they picked it up. Runs the ball more on third and pass than the Detroit Lions. Because what are you thinking if you're the defense? We gotta play pass.